What's up, YouTube? It's me, um, Lifted Veil Imagination Art, and in today's picture, I'm going to show you some of the creatures that are lurking in this nature photo, and I'm going to bring them out for you. So, um, let me jump right into it, and I'm going to start right away with a tree creature, and I'm going to start with his lips. And from his lips, I'm sure you can kind of tell from there. I think that's the best starting point for you guys to be able to see kind of where I'm going with this. There's his top lip and his bottom lip. Now I'm going to jump into his cheek area, his face. There we go. There's his, oh, no, that's not what I want to do. Okay. Alright, there's his cheek area. Sorry about that while ago, guys. I don't know what happened with the pen. There's his little cheeky, little puffy cheek around the side of his mouth. Over the top of his lip. Over here to the side of his little puffy cheek. <laughs> and then down. His body. his puffy cheek and over again out of his face underneath there we go now let's give his nose a slightly different shade of green okay so we can tell the difference i'm going to add a little orange in there to separate the nose from the rest of his face to help bring him out some. Then I'm going to give the top of his face <clears throat> a slightly different color green than the other greens I've used so far. Um, I'm going to go with a darker green, I think. This is going to be darker. Yes. Shadow around the top of his face, around over his eye, rest of his head, forehead, around the other eye, and back down. So you can see the contrast. Now I'm going to give him like something like what would be maybe little hands here. You can see coming. Kind of can't really see that one that good. And then I'm going to do his eyes. Okay. Color in the little nose there in his little mouth area. Okay. Then I'm going to give him a little bit that orange that I put in his nose right above the tops of his brow line here and there you have it now also lurking in the trees is another creature I'm going to give him an orange nose so right away once I do the nose you should be able to see him pretty well um, I'm going to give him his mouth next to help you see where I'm going with this okay then I'm going to come around with his um, color of his body I guess you'd say okay and he's a little bit obscured there's the top of his there's a the very very top of his head he's a creature who is a branch like tree creature who walks around I guess through the forest undetected somehow and I'm going to do the rest of his body here in brown it comes down this is going to be one of his legs and his legs is going to kind of obscure out of just out, out of justice out of the sea and um I was watching a criminal tv show earlier I guess that's why I'm saying that and then I'm going to come down here. Here's his other leg. And it's still obscured a little bit from the view all the way in some places. It comes all the way down. And then it turns into his foot. At the bottom. And then his arm. He has one arm here that you can't see. It disappears. And then his other arm is kind of lifted up into the air and you, it kind of disappears off into the distance as well. And then let's give him his eyes. And some pupils. And there he is. Now also he has a little friend in the background who is, you only can see just a little bit of his face 
So I'm going to start with his lips so you can see his lips and maybe you can see him. There's his lips or his mouth, okay? And let's give his nose a slightly different color so it stands out a little bit. Let's do his eyes. Give him his pupils. Okay, now I'm going to give him his color for his body. And color in his face color there a little bit. There's top of his head. There's his body. And it appears his arm is here. And it kind of swings around like this. But then that's all really other than this maybe right, this right here is part of his body. But the tree kind of running in front there is not. So he's kind of like entangled a little bit. And that's really all you see of him. Okay, now there is two more creatures lurking in this video or in this photo, and one is down here. He's like a frog-like creature almost. Um, there's around his eye, like around the side of his face, top of his head, in between his nose, I mean, in between his two eyes, around his eye. Then let's give him his um his lips. Now his lips are kind of funky. They almost look like a duck bill, but they're lips. Okay. Then let's give him a little nose. Then let's give him his eyeballs. Alright. And then let's do his body color. It's here. And here. And he's, his body, some of his body is hidden. And now he's going to have a little blue vest on. And there's his little blue vest he has on. Okay. And there he is. And now there's another creature I see. He's going to be over here. While I get my colors together, I'm going to circle that. He's going to be in this area. See if you can see him. And I'm going to get my colors together here. Okay, so we're going to do his, his cheek by his nose, okay, and underneath his mouth, alright, then I'm going to do his little hand, I see a little hand here, holding on, and then I see a little hand here, holding on, and then I see a foot here, in this area here, okay, and I'm going to go and do around the top of his head now with a slightly different color. Um, oh, this one here, I think. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, that's okay. Go around there, around his eye. Take around the other side of his little face. I'm going to color his little arm here. And get on up to his body. I'm gonna need to make his hand just slightly different color. It's a wee bit darker so it can be seen the difference better between his hands and his. There we go. And okay, come around like this. His little arm. There's his little legs. His little body. He's like hugged up against this um this tree somehow in like some weird dimensional interdimensional kind of way, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Um his little head. He's a little shaggy little creature. You know, his hair's shaggy. Let's give him his eyes. Give him his pupils. Give him a slightly pinkish nose. And then give him his little mouth that's open. Um... slightly pinkish red little mouth open there and there you have it and there he is and 
these are the creatures or some of the creatures there are more and you may see more but i didn't bring them out these are the creatures lurking in this nature photo and i hope you enjoyed it and again the thumbnail will be slightly different than this picture i mean than this video um because i went ahead and did the thumbnail first in order to practice my creatures before i just started doing them on here that way i didn't um have to edit my video and that way i didn't have to take as much time and i could get it done faster for you guys so thanks for watching if you like subscribe if you don't that's okay thanks for attempting to like my video and remember guys your imagination is a gift and if you've lost it it's because you didn't use it so use it people <laughs> okay peace